Hey guys, sup, 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 and before I head on out to the road, I'm going to make a poop ton of deck profile so I can get them out and record in between, like, travels and stuff. Um, quick question <clears throat> for the subscribers, um, do you guys want to see a channel update? Because I have a lot to say channel update-wise, it may take like 5-10 minutes to basically run everything down that's going to be happening through April, and it's kind of hectic, so I wanted to know if you guys are interested in that kind of thing. Um, if not, it's... It's all cool. Welcome to the Dragon Stars. These are the new Dragon types. And not everything has been shown at the time of putting this deck together. So please keep that in mind. Just finished through testing. This deck has been awesome. And it's something very different. But it's super spammy. Like everything I do is Advent super spammy. So um, we're going to be talking about this on Monday. Possibly sooner is Supply Unit. This card is dumb. But it comes out of the... Um, Comes out of the new starter deck, 2014. So let's go straight into the deck. We have one Thunder King Ryo, three Fire Dragon Star Shunji, three Mask Chameleon, one Arch Fiend Eater, three Earth Dragon Star Hyken, and three Light Dragon Rufin. Now, when I upload this, this is a brand new deck, so I'm going to just run down everything and then break everything down for you and then show it to you in a dual video so the two videos correspond with one another. One Dark Hole, three Pod Duality, because the most of the special summoning that you do in this deck is on your opponent's turn, except for when you're actually going for that Synchro Player, that Mask Chameleon, which we'll get to in a minute. Um, three MST, Hate Back Row, three Supply Unit, because Supply Unit, it's it, these guys just like constantly float. Regardless how they die, they constantly float. So as long as they hit the Grey Red, they constantly float. You're constantly drawing, and I have a replay where I get down to like the last card in my deck. Because of Supply Unit, it's just dumb. Uh, trap one up is bottomless, double mirror force, rental, uh, double trap stun, double D prison, one compulse, triple Phoenix chain. I would play um, bottomless trap hole because Medulce's, but this is going to be post Medulce's. Like, you know, it's going to be the set after, so I can't really decide upon what's going to be happening then. So I just go with what I can and base it off some OCG stuff. Three call the haunted, one warning. Call the haunted is just dumb in the deck. Let's break down the deck. Okay. Um, when this card you control is destroyed either by battle or card effect, and this is how most of them work, you can special one Dragon Star monster from your deck, except the one that is destroyed. Um, they all, they also carry their own effects, basically like when this guy is Synchro Summon, the Synchro monster gains 500, meaning that a Stardust will be at 3,000, um, a possible Mistworm would be at 3,000, a Black Rose would be at 2,900, a Catastrophe would be at 27, it just gets Brolic from there. Um, so, great card, definitely. It has zero defense. So, this means that the Tuner Mask Chameleon allows you to snatch you from the graveyard. They have their own theme boss monster and something that does support them as well. This is the Reincarnation Dragon. We'll get to that when we get to the extra deck. But this is this is the main guy that basically makes the deck. And his actual stats are 2300. Dead Pro has an updated B4 warned if you're going and running on Dead Pro and building this. It's still very, very highly glitched. Now, Archfiend Eater, um, you only need the one. And the reason you only need the one is because at your opponent's end phase, you're going to destroy your Dragon Star, and this guy's going to come back. That fuels Supply Unit, and also fuels your Dragon Star, which allows you to do a lot of stupid things. So, say I have three Supply Units, and yes, there's actually been times I have three Supply Units, and I have a Dragon Star in the graveyard, I can constantly go plus four. <sighs> really, why do you constantly go plus four in decks? Because I can. It's just, the deck is amazing. It like not it, it's hard to place it meta wise until we play test it more and we can have a whole discussion on how stupid the deck is and how it's gonna make dragon rulers a thing again because it kinda can but that they don't need dragon rulers. Dragon rulers need them. That's kinda the way it works. Um I don't see the deck really running dragon rulers. But you can because of the attributes, you just can't run title. Um and Tempest because there's no wind yet. It's like fire, earth, and light. You can go uh, Landois, but basically Mask Chameleon, this entire deck is a one black, is, is like a one card Black Rose, one card level 8 Synchro, um, one card, like, just everything in the extra deck except for the, the 4s and the seven, uh, sevens. Uh, the 4s and the 5, that, pretty much that's it. But, honestly, like, I could see Mask Chameleon going up in price, not because of how good the deck is, just because of hype for the deck, so... Um, if this deck looks interesting to you, you're planning to build it, pick up your Mask Chameleons today, and I will have that in the stock market video that you should pick them up now. Um, I'm probably going to put out a video of what cards you should pick up 
you know, this month to be prepared for August as crazy as that sounds, but, you know, massively prepared equals a lot of good stuff. So, um, supply unit, constant draw power, that's the true heart of the deck, that and duality. It's like dig, 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 search, 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 draw, 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 battle recruits. The only thing the deck really needs, the core of the deck, before we hit the extra deck, is a theme pod duality. And I know people are going to hate me for that. But Ryu, why do you think it was banned? Honestly, I think it was banned to promote pod of, um, duplicate. Like, it's, the, it's the secret rare one. But that thing is just so bad, it could work in here. And I've thought about putting it in, but... Honestly, I have Daigasu Emerald in the extra deck that I could just go off Mask Chameleon on, so it's, like, never really needed. And I have Call of the Haunted to make my plays for when I do that, and you can actually run multiple Scrap Dragons, which is hilarious. Let's go into the extra deck, shall we? One Miss Worm. One Jewel Red Dragon Archfiend. If you don't know about this guy, oh my god, he comes at the end of summer to the TCG, and he's ready to mess some faces up. He's a good version of Red Dragon Archfiend, and he will find your way, his way into your extra decks where you make the eights, trust me. Um, one Scrap Dragon, one Starter Spark, three Shining Dragon Star Shofuku, I believe I said that right. Um, when this card is synchronous, somebody could target any number of cards on the field, up to the number of different original attributes of the Dragon Stars, that's the trans translation there. Use a synchro material monster. Shuffle those targets into the deck. And once per turn, you can target one card you control and one level 4 lower monster in the graveyard. Destroy the first target. And if you do, special the second target from the graveyard. So it's kind of like having a themed scrap dragon while also having a Bryonac. The only problem is if you try playing this on Dead Pro as of today, April 1st, no April Fool's jokes, then it's not going to work. Just so you're forewarned, there's a lot of glitches going around. This is the Manga Black Rose Dragon. This is Moonlight Rose Dragon. When this card is special, or level 5 or higher monster special to your opponent's side of the field, you target one special summon monster, excuse me for that, um, your, your opponent controls, and you bounce it back, all the way back. It's just, it, it's a wonderful thing. You could do it all Call of the Haunted. I just like having the option there. Oh, and it's light. One Black Rose Dragon, because Black Rose Dragon is the greatest level 7 synchro to ever walk the face of the earth next to Dark Strike Fighter. One Catastor, three, two Reincarnation Dragon, Samasa, Samasa. I would probably play uh, three if possible, but it, it's got to be destroyed by the opponent's card effect, and that's kind of what hurts me when I'm trying to play this thing. Um, one Balmug, Knight of the Evil World. This thing is just so stupid in this deck, because when it's destroyed by the card effect and sent to the graveyard via, like, Torrental, you know, you just don't want to let it die by battle, then... Um, yeah, I just, I'm making sure. And then you can just get one of the Dragon Stars and go back from there. It's just, it, it's so good. 101 is an out to Ophion, which is a big hindrance to this deck. Even though I don't think Evil Storms are that great anymore. And one Digusto Emerald, because Digusto Emerald, like I said, the deck needs recycling. Any more questions, leave them in the comments below and I'll get to them. There will be a dual video that follows this. I'm going to try to get out just as fast as I can. I'll catch you next video. My name is Ryu for the Yu-Gi-Oh! Council. If you like what you saw, make sure to leave a like. That stupid like button thing that YouTube has down below underneath the video player. Uh, comments if you have something to say or you just feel like saying first, second, third, fourth, fifth, eighteenth. I don't care. Leave it down there. And subscribe for more. I'll catch you next video. Peace.